What is up guys? Today we are going to be making a devil fruit in Roblox Studio. So before we get started, I actually tell you guys, um, I used to make, um, on my old account I had one like this. And I'm going to show you guys the new version because I saw in the comment section there's like some problems. Anyways, we're gonna, um, what is it? We're going, to, I'm gonna show you the fur, um, how to set it up and some other stuff. So first of all, we're gonna go to Toolbox, and there's a link in the description to the model. And when you click it, it goes like this. Um, it shows this. And to use it, all you're gonna do is follow what I do. So here's the thing. You just press the arrow. So you get this replicated storage. You put it into replicated storage. You right-click it and you press ungroup, and you just ungroup. Do that same process of ungrouping into the other parts and none of the other parts so whatever it says to put it ungroup it in so for this it says starter pack or workspace so you can put this wherever you want because this is the fruit and basically if you want it in a chest then the fruit will be in the chest and when you touch the fruit you get it so anyways here's how it works all right so for the work all you do is get your flame fruit and you left click it then I have this item called flame. You click the flame item. There's only one move and you press X to fire fist. Fire fist basically shoots a fireball um, which is from your chest. Wherever you're facing, your character is facing, it will shoot it. Just know that there's no AOE damage for now. And it just shoots and it will and just destroy whoever, um, damage whoever touches it first. And not anyone around it. Has a cooldown like a few seconds. And now that you've seen how it works, I'm gonna show you how to edit it up. First of all, for the flame fruit, um, not the flame fruit, you can change the handle. So you see this handle, this is a handle. Handles are basically item, whatever you hold. So if I get a part and I name it handle with a capital H. Wait, hold on, I spelled that wrong. So, just follow me. So on properties of the handle, you would turn off, you would make your anchors off. Now, if we put this inside the flame fruit and remove the old handle, this will just give you a brick and that's your new fruit. I know you don't want a brick for your fruit, but yeah, that's how you customize it. So you can find whatever, you can make your own fruit models, then put, um, name it handle for capital H and put it inside the fruit. And that's how you customize the handle. Next, we're going to be showing you scripts. So these are a bit more complicated, but if you know how to script, then this is simpler. So first we have the fire fist. So go to server strip service, fruits, flame, arrow, and fire fist. So in here, we have many things. So first of all, this is the thing. Humanoid, well hum, meaning humanoid, take damage 25. This can be anything. If I made this a thousand, anyone who would hit this would take a thousand damage. It's crazy, but you can do it. Now next is this. So right here, BV. So right this number right here, you can change it to whatever you want, and that's how fast the projectile moves. So hundred is like an an average speed. So yeah. And now I recommend not touching anything if you do not know how to use this stuff. But so yeah. And next is um, the fire model. So in the fire fruit um, section of replicated storage, there's a thing called fireball. And it has, it's basically just a block. So if you want to make a new fireball, all you can do is, for instance, I'm going to make a, a sphere. Then you would turn off can collide, anchor is off, and I'm pretty sure that's it. So remove your old fireball. Name it fireball, just how I do it. And I'm going to call this red for fireball effects. Now put this inside the fire fruit section of replicated storage. And it should let you um, have a new fireball. Let me just eat my fruit. Fireball, there you go. It's a new fireball. There you go. So you can use your own models to make the fire fruit. And now another thing we can I want to talk about 
is um, the handheld foods. It's really, and I mean really important. So, so as you see, this thing called um, in the handheld foods of server server stores, handheld foods, flame, and GUI. So this mainly the skills. So as you see right here, it says skills. Is this? I'll put it into starter GUI. This is right here, and we can see what we have. So if you open up skills and open up frame, there are some text labels. So we have this one, which shows that this is the text label. If we right click and click on um, duplicate, you can duplicate it and make a new move. So if you add your own move, you just say like fire, let's say fire um, punch. And then you put like, I don't know, like in um, brackets and then just the keyboard like C. So that's um, another thing you can do. And and you can even customize the whole thing if you want. Also, in the handheld fruits, you can add new moves, and it's really simple. All you need is to get. Here's how you add more fruits. You just need replicate storage, this fist ability. You right click it and duplicate it. Then you rename it something else. Let's just say, um, punch. Now you get uh, now you get this fireball. Can duplicate it and I'm gonna color it blue so you can see the difference. Actually, not blue, orange. And we're gonna color this one, name this one Fire Punch. As you see, now all we need to do in the flame handheld fruits, click Fire Fist. No, not Fire Fist. You, you would duplicate it and call it Fire Punch. And now in this Fire Punch, here's what you do. You see Elsa um, right here. The key code dot and then that you put your key bind it has to be in the list of all of this so C and then um, right here it says events you would change that so instead of um, this you do punch okay next in server script service in the fruit section flame fire fist you will duplicate that as well and I'm gonna just rename it so that you can tell what it is, fire punch. Um, Alright, so in here you see um fire fruit, fire ball, instead you do fire fruit, fire punch. And right here, game that replica storage and then fist. I see it says fist right here, you say punch. And then everything is just up to you. You can edit some stuff actually. So I what I would do is just have a ten and then here wait i forgot to tell you wait you can just say like one second 0.5 seconds so it will destroy in points five seconds of launching it so i'm pretty sure that's all you need. and then also of course you put your start ui skills put it back into handheld foods um i think it was yeah inside the make sure you put the skills inside the gui script now it should work if it does not work then we just need a get a few extra touches flame fruit flame fire punch we have a very slow but very cool fire punch wait there you go so that that's how you use the flame fruit kit that i made thank you guys for watching i hope you have a good day um, if you enjoy my content, like and subscribe. And just know I'm going to be making some more um, new Roblox studios and tutorial types of videos from now on. But comment down below if you want to see me do other stuff too. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.